And CRPO Chief Guillermo Elizar says that the supposed bomb threat uh, that happened to a mall is nothing but a hoax and an old one at that. The threat had been making rounds in texts and social media. It says that the Abu Sayyaf will bomb one of the SM malls if management don't hand over or does not hand over $15 million within a week. The message allegedly came from a certain Kaila Avonase, who's purportedly an SM employee. However, the mall operator quickly denied the existence of such a threat. They say that the supposed information had been going around for three years now. SM further clarified that they've already investigated the matter and that the message is purely a hoax. Plus, the company also denied that there's a Kaila Avonace working for them. So, 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 CRPO Chief Eliazar added that if there's indeed a real threat, SM would have immediately asked for their help. The NCRPO Chief reminded the public that if there is a legitimate threat, they will be informed via traditional media and not through SMS or social media message blasts. Sure, Dave, na wala naman talaga tayong uh, real threat na natatanggap. At uh, yung ang ating palalay sa kanila, huwag tayong maging bahagi ng pagba ng pagibigay ng uh, alarm and panic sa iba do sa pag uh, you know pag forward ng mga text messages na hindi naman makakatulong. Unang-una that is an extortion text.